if I had a boy, mm -hmm. I wouldn't be doing this. Right. I would have, I would have to wait till he turned 18. You feel me? Or oh, whatever the case may be. But shit, circumstances right. would have been like this. I would have still did it like this. But if, you know, if I had a boy, I, I ain't wasting no, I ain't wasting no gay niggas though. Yeah. You feel me? That's yeah. just serious. So I'm like, I'll do this till I turn. So now, now let me go. Let me, let me. <laughs> now you just said you not raising no gay niggas. I ain't raising no. Yeah. <laughs> yo, 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 yo. Thanks for tuning in to Robbie TV. Hope you're enjoying the content we're putting out on a daily basis. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to the channel, share the videos. Remember, guys, participation helps the circulation. All right. Today we have uh, Mr. or Mrs. J. Miss <laughs> J Miss Jada Smith. Yeah. Okay, Miss Jada Smith. All right, so Miss J Miss Jada. Well, that is that what you want me to call you? That's my J is my name. I go my, I go by Jada. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna do J for short. All right, J. Okay. All right, J. Okay. I want to thank you for being a part of RB3 TV and giving um giving me the opportunity to get some insight on your story, who you are, and your experiences. Uh, I asked you earlier when we met if you what you identified as, and you told me you identify as transgender, correct? Right. Jay, why don't you give us a little insight and uh, let's start from the beginning. I guess early childhood, you know, on up, and you know when you first noticed that you were, you know, uh, liking men, right? Well. I knew I was a woman when I was out. I always knew I was a girl. Okay. First. So I, I, knew, I never did it for the man because I feel like if you do it for the man, it's not like what's the what's the real, it's like that's aesthetic purposes like for doing it and like if you're not doing it for the right reasons, you should just like, find, if you do it, do it for the right reason because it's a, it's a life altering choice and you got to live with it for the rest of your life. But I always knew I've been a woman. I always felt like a girl growing up. Um, I just recently, um, well, you know, I just recently started doing it, so I'm like, like last year, mm -hmm. so I'm like, um, I see results, so I ain't tripping. So when you say start doing this, you mean uh, the transformation? Yep. The, the, it, and that's a wig that you have on? It's a, it's a wig. It's okay. A wig. My, my real hair long, too. My, it's like, the, the, the hormones, it make your hair grow, like, really, really long, it make your nails grow, like, everything, like... The the breast the the nails the, uh -huh. the okay all right so now when you were when you were a child let's just say uh, did did you have a two parent household or, or a single yes I had a two parent household but myself still married so your parents are still married mm -hmm. okay how how was the relationship with you and your father it's good um, as long as I did good in school and respect my mama and um my brothers and sisters out I always got what I wanted. Um, well, not always, because mm -hmm. it wasn't always good like that. But if it, was, if, it, if, it, if it was, it was. You know what I mean? Like, when it was, it was. But. So, was it, I mean, was it rough? Like, like when did, when did your father realize that you want like, your... Because how many brothers you have? I have six brothers and one sister. Okay, and out of all your siblings, are you the only one that... I, I, got, a, I got a transgender sister, too. I got a little transgender sister. Okay, so that means your your brother yeah. is okay. So two of y'all. Mm -hmm. Okay, so who who made the transformation first, or who was noticed first? Mm -hmm. You are you the are you the oldest? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. So when did your father realize this? Well, he didn't know. They still they still didn't know I was gay until I turned eighteen. Okay. So I was like, uh, I found it when, on my eighteenth birthday. I had told them, and like they at first they did they didn't accept it because you know like. I was, it's just a phase type thing, but shit, I started, I ain't feel good, I ain't feel right, so I was just like, started doing it. Started messing like, with me? Like, uh, no, I, okay. I, I didn't have sex until I turned, like, I ain't start messing with men until I turned, like, 20. Okay. Because I feel like, I'm not, I'm, I don't have to have sex, and I didn't have, I don't, I don't like sex, so I'm like, so uh, sex don't appease me. I only do it for my partner and for a pleasure, but I don't, I don't need sex. That's what's up, man. That's what's up. You better than me, shoot. I jumped off the poultry early. <laughs> I got a daughter, though. You got a daughter? Uh-huh. How old? 
She fifty years old. Yeah, that's what that was my next question. Have you ever had some 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 coach? Oh, uh, that's I had that. That's what I had. You know, you gotta always know what it is. Right. So I had um I tried a girl. I had tried having sex with a girl like when I was like seventeen, and I had a little, I had a daughter. Okay. Uh-huh. She, oh Lord. <laughs> I will get you. Oh, is it? <laughs> okay. Okay. Hello. <laughs> Well, well, so so, give me some insight on your daughter. How, do you see your child? Um, actually, she got adopted. My, uh-huh. my, we was a CPS when, it, when she was born, so um, she was born. So, oh, you and the mother, you and the mother yeah, were CPS. I was, I was going through like behavior problems. Okay. At the time, because my, da- my dad's brother used to rape me and stuff like this, so I used to um. Oh. I used to tell my mom. I used to, I I didn't tell nobody for a long time until I tell people, and it's like. So I don't want to get too too. I don't want to you know bring back too many harsh memories or anything like that. Um, when you say rape, were you talking like fully penetrating you? No. Or, uh, no, I'll just give him blowjobs. I remember. You know, and, and how old were you at this time? Um, I was young. Like. And this was, oh, I think it out six. And this was your father's brother? Mm-hmm. Wow. I'm 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 sorry that happened to you, brother. I well, mean, as long as the abuser I'm as long as the abuser don't come to the abuser in my situation, yeah. I feel like I'm good because as long as I I don't know, I don't like being in chains, you know, so I'm like very much so if I could I don't got I ain't got to put you good. Do you think that's one of the reasons why you don't like sex as much? Yeah. Yeah. 